2014 was a big year for video. It was all about trying to reach the consumer and making them feel the feels. To cry when families reunited, when gifts were delivered via baggage claim, or even when regular people were just giving these amazing experiences, unbelievable experiences. And it was really good, you know, because it was very authentic. So the only problem with it was, was that it got done again and again and again. And, and as every brand looked for their WestJet moment, uh, it just started to feel a bit overdone. 2015, we'll see brands trying to make that genuine connection once again. So what can we expect to see from brands? For one thing, the use of new technologies, things like virtual reality, where the technology is getting to a place where it's becoming very accessible and uh, we're starting to see some great stories being told. One that I really liked recently was the Destination BC virtual reality experience where viewers actually got taken right into beautiful British Columbia. So brands are also starting to get a lot more sophisticated in their video strategy. And we see that in, in new ways like long form content. This has been around for a while. We've seen Chipotle and Patagonia have great success with this. But I think that we'll start seeing a lot more of it and brands being more open to trying new things in the new year. We'll also start seeing a bigger focus on new types of personalities and influencers in the videos themselves. Recent studies showed that YouTubers are actually more influential with millennials than traditional celebrities in mainstream entertainment. YouTubers will basically run the show as content producers. They bring their own built-in audience to the videos, which is amazing for distribution. And they're really great at creating stuff that their audience loves. That's exactly what they do. So we'll start to see brands being smarter about this and using them better this year. So if 2014 was the year of advertising and making consumers feel the feels, hopefully what we'll see in 2015 is really uh, more nuanced, more sophisticated, and more varied types of video content coming from brands. Audiences are maturing and brands need to realize that and start producing the type of content that they are interested in watching.